Oh, what height. Adam Cole is here with one thought in mind to shock the system. One of the young guns in NXT. Very. And so it begins. Despite triple threats being every man for himself, history has shown that the match's dynamics can create. Un I would be remiss if I didn't mention, and it's important to remember amidst the chaos of a triple threat match, that victory can be achieved in many different ways, and that it's every man for himself. A lot of times, the smart move in a match like this is to sit back in the weeds, let the other two superstars tear each other apart. Let's see if we get any of that here tonight. What a clothesline! Good grief! What a stomp! Good grief! What a clothesline! Good grief! Vertical suplex! Nice! And Zagiri finds its mark. The Neck breaker! They get dangerous out here, especially when there are no countouts. Uh-oh, watch out! Double rusted leg sweep! Drop kick hits the mark! Looking a little out of it, up on that turnbuckle. Now this could very well be the beginning of the end. Oh man, that hurt the back. Spine rattling. What a stomp. Good grief. AJ Styles brings it every night, but the Royal Rumble pay-per-view has been quite significant in the career of the phenomenal one. They get dangerous out here, especially when there are no countouts. He looks a bit off his game here. This is a dangerous spot for him to be here in this triple threat match. Michael AJ Styles Royal Rumble history begins in the Rumble match itself. Styles entered third, scored some eliminations, and lasted nearly a half hour against a procession of WWE's best. Yeah, and then the next year, AJ Styles had an all-time classic at the Rumble, taking on John Cena at Royal Rumble 2017. Styles, like the Rumble itself, has been simply phenomenal. He's getting after it while he has the energy. Smart move. Slam. AJ Styles caught a bit off guard there, which is a rare sight. In February of 2017, SmackDown Live was lit thanks to an epic triple threat match for the WWE Championship. Styles has him up. Point of the elbow, nailed it. Ooh, what a jawbreaker. What a strike. Oof. It's not often that the WWE Championship is incapacitated before a title defense. John Cena and AJ Styles rekindled the rivalry with a renewed enthusiasm for destroying one another. Bray Wyatt ended the match and made up for lost time as the Eater of Worlds used his body as a weapon. It was pure chaos as AJ Styles followed suit with an unbelievable array of aerial attacks on both superstars. And John Cena continued to fight back in hopes of winning a record-breaking 17th World Championship. All three superstars pulver up shoulders on the mat. At 2016's Clash of Champions, it was another classic triple threat match for the Raw Women's Championship. It was Bailey versus the boss, Sasha Banks, versus the champion, Charlotte Flair. The match started out more like a singles match between the boss and the queen. Bailey learned very quickly it was every woman for herself. This could be huge. The triple threat match for the Raw Women's Championship was another example of the incredible competition between the female superstars of WWE. Charlotte was physically dominant in fighting off the challenges of Bailey and Sasha Banks. At one point, the Queen even landed a moonsault on both their opponents at the same time. But the boss and Bailey put it all on the line and kept fighting. There were several near pinfalls during this battle, but in the end, 
as it should be, the queen exhibited her genetic superiority by fighting off both her challenges. You only got one. Oh. <laughs> but I don't know how much he's got him covered. One, two. Dug down deep and gets the shoulder up. There is no quit in this man tonight. Ooh. Styles looks like he wants to do it all by himself. Takes him down hard. You gotta love that kind of aggression. Hooked up. Ushiguroshi. Just when you thought he had nothing left. Just as devastating the second time around. Styles Clash. That has got. He's going for the pin. What a win. Talk about seizing opportunity. Those three superstars laid it all on the line, as we can see right here in these clips. These guys showed flashes in this match, but flashes don't exactly set the world on fire, as these highlights show very well. That's a win you remember for a long time. Is there a club for losers Finn Balor can join after that performance? Yeah, the Sax Club. And as we expected, WWE Extreme Rules has been a brutal evening.